Uh, good evening, everyone. Thank you so much for joining us at this party. I hope you have learned so many things going through all the steps. I know it can be overwhelming, but the more you learn and better yourself, the better off your families are going to be. Um, I just wanted to start off with why I chose um, to sell and be a part of Norwex. Most of you don't know me, but my son was born three months early and therefore has lung and trachea issues. And that results in us being rushed to the emergency room every month and a half to two months because something has irritated it and he swells almost completely shut before I get him there. So I knew that I needed to make a change. Um, my journey with um, health started a long time ago, well, about six years ago. Um, I started using essential oils. I got rid of the medications in our home. Um, and then eventually I started switching out my beauty products because I didn't realize how many harmful chemicals were in there. And now I have found this company that has helped my son. Um, are you the kind of person that when you clean, you get a headache or you start feeling nauseous? Those are outward signs, but what's happening inside? So um, using cleaning products and the fumes and chemicals that are in there is just as bad as smoking 20 cigarettes a day. Um, the, the word fragrance has been linked to more lung cancer than smoking cigarettes as well. So I knew I had to make a change, not that we smoke, but I knew I had to make a change in my home. Um, so I decided to do it all at once. I knew that I did not want a single harmful chemical around my son. And if I could protect him inside of our home, then I was doing something right. I can't protect what happens outside, but I can protect him here. Um, and so far, so good. And these products are just amazing. I cannot believe how well they work with mostly water. The things that we have that aren't with water are enzyme based. Um, so nothing harmful in there, nothing that will get in your lungs and your chest. It's all made from natural enzymes. So what I wanted to do today was show you our top 10 things. I used to go crazy when I had a party because I wanted to show everything. I loved everything and then people would get overwhelmed and I do not want that to happen to you. So I'd like to show you our top 10 things and then I'll show you a few of my favorite things and we will go from there. But let me start with this. So most people don't realize and so I'm here to educate, right? Um, this one I knew before I joined Norwex but more than 200 chemicals have been found in cord blood if, of newborns. That to me is crazy, 200 chemicals. It's absorbed in our skin. It only takes 26 seconds once something touches the skin to enter the bloodstream. So think about that when you're using Windex or bleach. Um, it's very harmful. 95% of people don't wash their hands long enough to kill bacteria. I knew that my kids didn't wash their hands enough, but it says all people. So to me, I was like, ew. And antibacterial soaps weaken your immune system. I am trying to get my son's school to not use antibacterial wipes, the Clorox wipes, or um, hand sanitizer anymore um, because of how it weakens the immune system. And our kids are always sick, right? Um, another thing that I love about Norwex is they are so earth conscious, um, trying to make it better with our products and not polluting the air. The sad thing is, is by the year 2050, there will be more plastic than fish by weight in our oceans. That to me, I love the ocean. I love to go there. And every time I go there, I see more and more trash and that devastates me. We have ways to not use um, as much plastic. Um, another thing that goes along with that is 51,000 trees are cut down daily for North America's paper towel habit. Mind blown. Really that much? We rely on paper towels that much? Now I, I'm going to tell you, I was a Costco bulk buying paper towel mommy. I use paper towels for everything. I have a solution for that. We don't use as many paper towels, not nearly as many. I used to use a roll every two days. 
Um, now I've used a roll, I'm still on the same roll in 30 days. So that's cut back and I use it on bacon because we eat a lot of bacon because we're on the keto diet. Um, so that's what I use it a lot on. Um, 3,000 tons of paper towels, uh, paper towel waste is created every day. The average household contains about 62 toxic chemicals. I firmly believe that if you include your body products, your makeup and everything, this number will double. I firmly believe that. All right, and this one was a big one for me. Um, actually, these next two, and then I'm done with the cards. Um, but because my son had so many issues, this one just spoke to me. Did you know that dust mites may be the worst common trigger of year-round allergies and asthma? Let's talk about dust mites. I thought that dust mites were something only dirty people had. Everybody has them in their bed. What do dust mites do? They poop. Yuck. And the poop left behind gives us horrible allergies, chest infections, um, and like I said, the allergies. Since we, I used, um, but I'll show you in a minute for my mattress, uh, we stopped taking our allergy medication or allergy oils. Uh, we haven't been using them. And I sprayed it on my kid's bed. And again, knock on wood, he has not been taken to the hospital since. Okay, and this one. I am not a shoe... I don't take my shoes off when I come in my house. I wanted to, it just never ever happens. 85% of contaminants are brought into our home in the first four steps. Gross. And I know my floors were not being cleaned enough um, for my kids to be crawling around on. And if I was cleaning with Lysol, my kids are down there on their hands touching it, putting their hands in their mouth, cleaning the windows with Windex, putting their tongue on the window, right? My two-year-old does that all the time. So those are just some things that pop out to me. We have a whole bunch more I could read, but I'm not going to do that. So I would like to talk about the very first of the 10 products. This is the backbone of Norwex. Let me grab it. Okay. This is called our Enviro cloth. E-N-V-I-R-O cloth. Okay. Enviro cloth. Why is this cloth so important? It's the backbone of Norwex. It has, it's made with microfiber. What does something need to be to be called microfiber? It has to be one sixth the hair, the size of a human hair. This is not one sixth the size. This is one two hundredth the size of a human hair, making it very dense and absorbent to grab all the germs. Okay, this one rag, which is this size, okay, contains 10 million microfibers, 10 million, which can reach from Canada to the Gulf of Mexico. The other thing that is in this cloth, we line our cloths with silver. Silver is known, silver and copper are known to self-disinfect, self-purify. So in a minute, or in a few minutes, I'm gonna show you a raw chicken demo with this cloth. I will show you that the bacteria is not there. It kills it and it locks it in, okay? So all of our cloths have what's called back lock in it. So it kills the bacteria. It's all lined with silver, okay? So this is the backbone of our company. Now this, I was very hesitant uh, when I used this. I saw the demos, um, but still, my mind doesn't think that way, right? I have cleaned so many things. The thing that I thought the most was I was using some tanning lotion, and I have since stopped using it because I, re I researched the ingredients, um, but I opened my tanning lotion, and it popped all over the floor, leaving my parents, because I went to my parents' house, I left their white carpet brown. I left it there for about three hours because I did not know how to tell my parents. And then all of a sudden I said, I'm going to try my Enviro cloth. Got it wet. Just water. Took it right up. No remnants of it. I had my mom watch. My mom, 
look what I did and watch and see if this works. It was amazing to me. Um, this cleaned my walls where my kids touch. Um, you, I'll show you this in a demo in a minute with our next cloth. I will use, I will clean a window or a mirror. Um, I'll rub butter on it. So you get this wet and you clean your windows still wet and then you take the next cloth and it leaves the most beautiful clean windows you've ever seen so that was our number one because that is the backbone of our product of our company the next one is called the window cloth so these two should be married they make a great team so like I told you you wash the window with just water and your Enviro cloth then you dry it with this this polishes makes it look so shiny it also works very well on your water faucets your silver water faucets it works well on stainless steel um, getting all those spots and kids fingerprints off works great to shine anything um, granite countertops marble countertops all of those things love this cloth I'll show you a demo with that in a little bit as well I'm gonna put these back all right, the next one, which is my oldest son's favorite, is this dusting mitt, and my husband's too. So one of the first things I did when I got my packet in was I let my son dust with this. Oh, it's wonderful, it electric charges and no chemicals. What I call um, Pledge and Lysol, I call them job security because it leaves a film on your furniture that attracts more dust have causing you to have to dust more often and mop more often now if you have kids you have to mop a lot anyway but um, so this my son loves to put his little hand in there and dust everything now what wowed me with this was our screens on our windows um, our screens we live in a condo and our screens are so dirty I cannot figure out how to get them clean I've wiped and everything I got this wet with just water, cleaned the inside, went outside, cleaned the outside. It did not look like we had a screen. My husband was floored. He thought this was the best thing ever created. And it holds the dust in there, even if you um, wet it with the screens on the windows. This thing is wonderful, and it will make your kids want to clean if you have kids. <laughs> All right, the next one. Oh no! I forgot our mop handle okay so the next one is our mop let me talk about the mop handle I feel so silly I actually know it's in the car because I had a show last night I'm gonna show you this paper just to kind of show you the mop handle um, but you'll see in previous posts about the mop so the handle is like this okay so why do I talk about the handle it is awesome my little five-year-old can mop and does he love to mop he does and he does a great job at it because it the handle goes really short or you can twist it and my six foot four husband can mop he doesn't but he could <laughs> um, so why is this mop so special I did not want a new mop but it came with the packet I selected because I have mops that shoot out hot steam um, hot water I have all the different kinds of mops the Bona the shark uh, and my floors never felt clean enough to me so this was the very first thing I did and when my husband walked in from work that day he was amazed at how clean and shiny the floors were they had no streaks no film our floors have never looked better and I have two messy boys so um, this has the back lock in it remember I said 85 or 87 percent of contaminants are brought in in the first four steps so my family comes in the back gate and the front door so this has the back lock in it where it's lined with silver and it's tightly woven never have my floors felt cleaner with just water so there's different pads you can get this is for um, basically all floor services the wet one okay this is the wet because it's blue blue for water this is the dry one so if you're just picking up dust on the floor you put this on first it'll cling very very well I just realized I forgot something else too I'm so sorry um this picks up the dust very well um, and then you mop with the blue one now if you have tile floor so this works great on um, 
linoleum, um, wood floors, uh, laminate floors, and then this one works well to pick up all the dust. If you have animals, doggies and kitty cats, this one picks up all the hair. Um, this one does a pretty good job at the hair, but this one does an amazing job with the animal hair. But if you have tile floors, um, I was using just the regular blue mop pad, um, but then I got this for tile floor. It, the blue um, zigzags are scratchy, so it gets in the, um, the creases of the tiles. Why can't I think of what that's called? Um, it gets in, in there and really scrubs your floor. So the handle, I'm so sorry I forgot the handle. The handle will lock into place and you can extend it. So if you have a tall house and tall windows, you get it wet and you can scrub up and down. It is awesome for tall windows and if you're going to clean your walls. I've never scrubbed my walls until I got this mop. It's, it actually makes cleaning fun and I have never, ever found cleaning to be fun at all. But this mop is a coveted mop. Everybody wants the mop, which is why I'm so mad I forgot the handle. I'm so sorry. Um, but seriously, the mop is hands down worth every penny. They last a very long time. Um, my mentor has had hers for six years and hasn't had to replace the pads. Um, you can buy a rubber brush to go along with it. And you know how when you mop it gets those chunks on there? You take it and you brush down on the pad and it goes right in the trash can, the rubber brush. Um, so it doesn't leave it behind. Uh, I will typically wash it after a week, but I have messy kids, so I have that mop out all the time, mopping up milk and mopping up juice and everything. I wash them about once a week. Um, I have a little bin that I keep all my Norbeck stuff, all my claws, and when they're dirty, I throw them in there and I wash them all together. Um, you don't want to wash your Norwex with anything fluffy like towels. Um, you do not want to put fabric softener in them. Um, because it will ruin the workings of it. So, okay, number five. This was also something I didn't really want, but okay, it came with it. So, this is Power Plus Laundry Detergent, okay? It's a pretty small bag. It's not the smallest we have, um, but it you only use one teaspoon, not a tablespoon, one teaspoon in an HE uh, washing machine. This has gone so far, it doesn't have any scent to it, so it has no fillers, no SLSs, no optical brighteners, no animal testing, no dyes, no fragrance. Um, our, our noses are trick our brain because when we smell that lemony fresh, we know, oh, it's clean. So none of our products have a a, a strong um, scent like that. So what I do is I take an aluminum bottle and I put some water and a few drops of lemon oil and I'll spray my floor as I'm mopping it with just water anyway and it, it tricks my brain telling me that it is clean. So I do the same thing. I'll put some essential oil in my um, wash and let me tell you I used to have a problem with my husband's um, underarms. I could never get them clean. I used to have to um, put OxyClean on them um, it would leave that thick layer of deodorant and sometimes I would just throw his shirt away. Since having this, I haven't had to spray them, um, which I wouldn't use anyway because it's chemical filled. Um, the stains and the smell has come right out with this. And one teaspoon, I had a half size bag like this and it's lasted me two months. I have maybe a couple more washes and I have two dirty boys who play all the time and make so much laundry. So that is the laundry detergent. Along with the laundry detergent is, so I used to use Downy. I love the smell of Downy. But like I said, that fragrance, and especially in our cleaning products, get into our lungs. And that causes lung cancers. Um, and we're wearing it on our body. And what did I say about when it touches our body? Our largest organ, our skin, it gets in within 26 seconds it enters the bloodstream. So I started using laundry balls, but I, I wasn't happy with them. They didn't fluff my laundry. They were smaller. These are amazing. I put essential oils on this as well, lavender or lemon or how whatever I want my laundry to smell like. Um, 
I use doTERRA essential oils. So I put this one called Serenity on it. Oh, my laundry smells beautiful. But this pack comes with three. These are pretty large. My kids, I cannot let my boys get a hold of these. They throw them around the house. But they cut, they have cut my drying time in half. I love that because it's also saving me my energy bill, right? So cut my drying time in half and my clothes do not come out wrinkly. It, I don't know what happens, but they get in there and it fluffs it up and I'm not using a fabric sheet that would um, that would pollute our earth. Uh, they do not break down. It takes so many years for a laundry sheet to break down. Um, these are made of 100% wool. Um, it softens clothes naturally, like I said, and it my clothes come out so fluffy and I don't have to iron them, um, which I don't have time for anyway. Um, and then they don't have this loud noise in there either. I am in love with the laundry, um, the fluff and tumble balls. Okay, next is our almighty cleaning paste. You saw it in one of the posts, everything this cleaning paste can do. When I first got this, I wasn't quite sure how to use it. It's not pasty, it's actually rock solid. Um, I don't want to open it because I dropped it and it kind of got loose pieces. Um, but you take your Enviro cloth, swipe it across, get it wet, swipe it across a few times. It gets just enough on there. If you have a glass top stove, it will take all that stuff off that you can never get off. This cleaned the inside of my oven, no problem. Um, I did have some stuff in the back that I couldn't get because I just couldn't crawl in there and I got the oven and grill cleaner. Whoa! Sprayed that enzyme stuff on there and it worked a miracle but this uh, this is just you can use it on anything any surface even glass um, it's so fine it doesn't scratch and you can use it with the Enviro cloth if you're using it to actually clean off the top of the stove I recommend the Spiri sponge S-P-I-R-I -I sponge it's rough but it will not scratch your glass top so it's 100% protected from that and then just a little bit of water and dab it in here Everything shines. Anything you need. If you've got a stain on the floor, on your hard floors, your tiles. I know we had um, some sort of red stain. I don't know where it came from. I couldn't get it out of the tiles. I even tried bleach. I brought bleach in my home. It wouldn't take it out. This took it right off. No problem. Um, this will also last you a couple years. Um, they say a year, but my upline has used hers for two years and she still has some. And she says she uses it on everything. My dad used this on his headlights, you know, how they get all film and foggy. Um, he used this and it they were so clear and he just used it with the Enviro cloth and just scrubbed it and it didn't scratch it. It left them so beautiful. This is the number seven product. Uh, number eight product, I actually don't have because I don't have hard water, so I didn't order it. Um, but I found out that my neighboring city has horrible hard water and they flipped for this. Um, descaler for your shower heads and um, anything that builds up with the hard water um, it comes in a little spray bottle like this and apparently it works amazing we have soft water I'm so lucky that we have that um, but that is our number eight now what I brought instead of number eight is the mattress cleaner that I was telling you about this enzyme based mattress cleaner kills all that mite poop and I do it about every month I just spray the beds while I'm washing the sheets. I just let it sit there. And then when the sheets are dry, put them back on. You're good to go. And seriously, our allergies have been wonderful. I really recommend this for every household because you just don't realize how dirty your mattress is until you look into it. And so it's a little, little intimidating when you look into it. Okay. Our number nine is the Blue Diamond bathroom cleaner okay blue diamond it's an all-over bathroom cleaner but I can't show this without showing the bathroom mitt the mitts not on there and I don't understand so most of the time my son um, wipes down the bathroom there's a scrubby side to this and a fluffy side um, he knows when to use both sides uh, but he does it every day because I have boys and they go pee everywhere everywhere so he scrubs down the sink and then he gets in and does the bathtub. He has a blast doing it. And then he does the toilet. 
Then I take it and I wash it out with hot water, hang it up. I only wash it once a week. I use it every day, only wash it once a week. But also once a week, I use it with the blue diamond cleaner. Only three drops, three drops on here gives that fresher feeling. So three drops. This is also for inside the toilet. We have a toilet brush that is um, self sanitizing as well. Only three drops once a week if you scrub your toilet once a week, will last you a year um, for the toilet. Um, this, it works wonderful in, in um, the bathroom. So what I do sometimes in our bathtub, just for the extra clean, is I will have him put a little of that cleaning paste I just showed you, just a little bit, and man, it just polishes up my bathtub. So the bathroom mitt and the blue diamond, wonderful. Okay, the last top 10 item it might gross you out what I'm gonna say let me grab it okay. sorry I should have had that in reach these are called our body cloths um, it comes in a pack of three it comes in different colors I happen to have the graphite color I have not used soap on my body and I know it's gonna be hard because you can't smell me on video in over two months these have the back lock in them and they're microfiber. So it pulls all of the bacteria off your body. And let me tell you, my skin has never been softer. I used to have all the bumps everywhere. I have a mosquito bite right now, so, but my, my skin has never been softer and my, I haven't used any face wash either. I use my cloth. Now I'm not really handy with the cloth in the shower because I'm just not used to using it. But I, they do have a mitt that goes on your hand and it has a scrubby side. Sorry, my son is crying very loud. Um, it has a scrubby side and a soft side that's just like this. And I use the mitt in the shower because I love that scrub. Um, and they also have a long back. I think I have that one in here this back scrubber with the scrubby side and the soft side. Seriously, folks, I'm not dirty. I don't stink. Um, it really bothered me to not use soap, but I challenged myself if I was gonna tell people they didn't have to use soap, that I wanted to use it and my skin has never been softer. And I'm saving money because I'm not, I use a very high quality body wash. Um, I, I'm not using it, so I'm saving money that way. And for my kids as well, I haven't used soap on them. And they, so what, what are these good for also? Uh, if you have eczema, acne, you don't need all those extra chemicals um, to help it out. You just need something that pulls what's in there out. And my sons had acne on their elbows and knees. It's gone, it is gone. You can see where the little scars are from them scratching, but it's so smooth. Um, these are great for people with psoriasis, eczema, acne, amazing, um, yeah. Okay, so those are the top 10 products. Uh, let me grab a few things and show you some of my favorite things and then we'll do the demos, okay? All right, a few of my favorite things. I told you about the Spiri sponge that you use um, to get to use the cleaning paste and to get the glass top surface clean. I love the Spiri sponge It's like this it looks really rough and it is but it has a coating on it that will not scratch your surfaces. I Love this it gets everything off for me um, also I talked about paper towels and how we don't use them anymore. What do I use? Do I just use a ton of towels? No, I use these tiny little dishcloths Okay, they're little, like here's my hand. Oh. So they're smaller, but I use them stacked up in my kitchen, okay? They also sell a little metal house where they go in and I use that on my counter and my son grabs it every time he makes a spill, I grab it, try to grab the same one um, and use it for a couple days since it self sanitizes and then I'll throw it in the laundry and then move down to the next one. But it makes a really beautiful, um, counter decoration as well and then I'm not using paper towels I had to hide the paper towels for myself because even though I had those 
I was so used to going and grabbing a paper towel. So we talked about the Enviro cloth and how much I love it. Um, they have a travel pack of Enviro cloths. So they're little, right? I have one of these, so all of our towels have this hook on them. Also, all the towels say what they are, Enviro, okay? So you don't get them confused. Is this my bath cloth? Is this my kitchen cloth? Um, they all have it. I carry these as a clip on a clip of my purse with an optic scarf that is great for my glasses, my cell phone, my tablet, um, anything to get the spots off. It's the best glasses cleaner I have. So I hook this on there, the miniature travel, and I always have a bottle of water with me. So if I need to go to the grocery store and clean off that cart, and I'm not gonna use a Clorox wipe that they provide in the store, I will not do it for my kids. I'll just take this. I always have a damp one and I wipe off the cart. Or if we go out to eat, the table, the menu that's sticky, I wipe it all off first. I have to protect my kids. And I think I've kind of become a germaphobe because of it. Um, but I always have them handy. And it comes in a pack of five. Um, and these three colors and a pink one. I don't have the pink one with me because, of course, I left it. Um, I love the little travel Enviro pack. So. so, dishes. Let's talk about dishes. This is looks like a weird dishcloth. It's actually quite big. Okay, but it looks like a net, right? Scrubs dishes, amazing. If I have any bakers out there, if you put, you know how you get the flour all over your counter? If you take this, get it wet, go like this, pick up your flour. My upline takes this and shakes it over her laptop. I guess I should start doing that demo. The flour does not fall off. This really picks up stuff. I'm not a rag user though. I am a baker, but I use it when I bake, but not every day but it scrubs dishes well and another thing this does that my dad bought a ton of them for is gets the bugs off the front of the car um, so it's a little scratchy but it's not gonna scratch anything it won't scratch your car it get, takes those bugs right off this is an amazing cloth but I am more of a sponge user or a brush uh, like a bottle brush user so they have an Enviro sponge it has a scrubbier side and a smooth side so I know that I am getting the cleanest countertops possible, the cleanest dishes, if I hand wash or even if I'm just cleaning around, I know because it's got that back lock in it, it's tightly woven, and it's got the silver that kills the bacteria. And let me tell you, when this gets dirty looking, I throw it in the washing machine. I don't throw it away. So I'm saving money because I used to throw my sponges away all the time because they were gross wash it over and over and over again it gets multiple uses um one of my other my last favorite thing i'm going to show you i have so many more but i won't show them to you is this it doesn't look like a mop um i have these hanging they hang on towel racks or oven doors i'm so tired of my towels disappearing because they're pulled off the rack or on the floor or my kids wipe their hands and yeah they end up on the floor this hooks on and it has that back lock in it. It's so soft, the Chanel, and it dries my kids' hands. And I know they're not washing their hands well enough anyway, so it's pulling that extra bacteria off. I love these. We have them in uh, quite a few different colors that I love also, um, but this is another one of my favorite things. Okay, I have shown you so many products. There's so many more I could, but I'm gonna get to the demo now. So what do, what demo will I do first? I will do the butter demo. So here's a mirror, okay? You get to see my jewelry back there, ah, sorry. Um, so here's a mirror, I'm gonna stand up. It's gonna help me, sorry, I'm very sore. Okay. So here's a mirror, right? I'm gonna take butter. Rub it all over. I'm gonna try to get it to where y'all can see it. Rub it all over. That is just straight butter, okay? Sit it down. I'm gonna grab my Enviro cloth and just get it wet. It's actually cold water, it's not even warm. Okay. 
it's very dense, so it holds a ton of water. So I squeeze it out really well. Okay. All right. And if you take your Enviro cloth and fold it into quarters, you will have eight clean sides to use. I'm not gonna need eight clean sides to do this, but just a tip when cleaning. Okay, so here's that butter. Here's the Enviro cloth, okay? Kind of hard in this little mirror to show you, but that's okay. So you can kind of see, it's kind of hard to see, but you can see that there's still water spots on it, right? I'm gonna take my window cloth, polish that right up. How much Windex would you have to use to get butter off? There's no butter. It's not greasy. It's kind of hard to see on the video, and I'm sorry, but that is a shiny mirror. Okay, now the one that kind of grosses people out. The raw chicken demo. Okay, so I have a piece of raw chicken. I also have a ProClean protein swab. So if this, if there's protein when I swab, there will be these colors, right? If it's clear and no protein, it'll be green. I do not buy these from Norwex. I bought them off Amazon because, uh, well, Norwex does not sell them, but I wanted to show that there's nothing to worry about. So I buy these off Amazon. This is These are used in restaurants, um, restaurant uh, inspections to make sure that there's no bacteria around, okay? I'm going to take my raw chicken. Okay. Rub it here. You can see that I'm rubbing it, right? Okay. Rub, rub, rub. Okay, so you can see that on there. Okay. Put it away because I don't want to touch it. Okay. I'm going to take my Enviro cloth. Fold it over, not use the butter side. Okay. And I'm going to rub the chicken juice off. Okay. Oops. Okay. Now, I rubbed it off, didn't scrub it long. I'm going to take this, my protein swab, pull it out. Oops, let me put that down. Sorry. It's still wet. You can still see the water on there, right? Never dried it. This was the area I did the chicken in. Rub it all over. Okay. okay. Now I'm going to put this back in here and release. Sorry, I can't put that up anymore. Release the liquid, squirt it down in there. Come on. Okay. See? So green. Okay. Now. What else am I going to show you? Here's where I used the chicken. That's where I wiped all that chicken on. Okay? Ready? Still green. It pulled it and it started disinfecting it right away. Okay? It will turn purple. Touch it to that chicken. Purple, okay? I did a demo like this once with Lysol wipes and with bleach, and I did not get the same results. And I induced those, introduced those chemicals into my lungs. So those are my two demos. I could probably sit here all day and do demos. Now you've seen so much. Where do you start? I knew I had to start right away. I had to change everything in my home for the health of my son and my family. Both of my sons, but my youngest specifically. I knew I needed to jump in I bought a kit and I joined. I joined for the discount, but I bought I bought a kit which got me another free kit. It was amazing. Um, you could sell this. Let me tell you a little bit about it. 
Um, I joined a little over 60 days ago. In my first three weeks, I made $700. Um, I could not believe it that I had done that and I didn't work very hard for it. Um, I am now 60 days in, um, I have made $1,500 and I've only done a little bit. I, I don't spend a lot of time. I'm still able to have my boys at home. Um, I'm still able to work my business. This is the best opportunity that has come into my life and I have tried other um, companies. This People know that they need better stuff in their homes. Now, let's say joining my company is not for you. Even though I have an amazing team and I would help you succeed, I've also gotten $2,000 in free products just by doing what I'm supposed to do, right? Educating, okay? What do we need for this party? We need one person to host a party so she can earn all of the free stuff that she'll earn. Let's say, let's say we have $1,000 in sales. She won't earn very much because no one booked a party. That's just kind of how it runs. Um, but you could host a party and earn so much free stuff. I did a party last Sunday and it was $1,000. It was in home, in someone's home. And my host earned $470 in free stuff. Wouldn't that be wonderful for you too? We're hoping to get her there, um, but you could also get the products that way. Or you could just buy as a regular retail customer. Um, I have many of those. I would love many more. And um, we offer kits. Our most popular is the Safe Haven Kit. It's a little introduction for something um, for every room. Um, it comes with uh, fabrics, uh, laundry detergent. It comes with um, all kinds of cloths. It comes with a lot of things. I should have had it right here to tell you what it came with, and I'm sorry. Um, either way you choose, whether to join my team, host a party, you could host a party and buy, or if you chose just be a retail customer, um, either way you choose. I need people out there sharing the mission of this company. I, I'm on a mission to change homes one at a time to implement change. If you need help, if there's something that you just hate cleaning, I hate doing floors, I hate doing, you know, there's there's nothing I have for folding laundry. That's my thing. Who's going to fold my laundry? Um, please message me and let me know. You can comment here. I can respond to you. Um, thank you so much for joining us tonight. I know it may be a little bit overwhelming, um, but just sit there. Let it absorb overnight in your mind and then make your list. Place your orders tomorrow. You don't have to place them tonight. Um, the party will be open for probably four more days and I will be happy to answer all your questions. If you want to join my team, best decision I ever made. I honestly cannot say enough about it. Okay, guys, have a great night. Thank you for joining. Bye-bye.